Hey guys, don't mind the hair. I'm going to wash my hair in a minute. But I went to Ikea because I wanted to get the furniture that I was looking for. And I put them like right here for you guys to see. But instead I ended up not able to get anything I wanted before. And yes, I know it, it got wider. Don't come at my lashes. I know, I know. But I ended up just getting, this is their heat um, pads. Uh, got a better wine opener, so I'm getting rid of the one I have. Better measuring cups, gonna get rid of those. And the things I'm getting rid of are like things that are old and they just need to be replaced, but I'm not gonna replace a lot of the things. I got a better baster brush, um, better spatula. I finally got a potato masher. No more mashing with a fork. Potato masher. I got another towel, paper towel rack for the bathroom. I got some tongs, two um, dish racks, and a doormat. So, and then I got something else, but it wasn't what I thought I, it was when I was gonna, when I got it. So I'm gonna take it back. But I'm gonna put this stuff up, okay? Hey. Hey guys, so I'm at, at home. I'm by myself this time. I didn't bring any family. I really just wanna look and see the type of decorations and other things that I need that they have to see. So when I find some stuff, I let you guys know. So I'm at home. I show you guys what I find when I get home, but I ain't never. Let's keep falling out. I ain't never have seen at home this bear before. Like. They got like a couple stuff. I'm walking past the Christmas stuff because I'm gonna go look at it. And I got a couple Halloween stuff. But I never seen them this big. Like there's not a lot of kitchen selection. And there's not a lot of, you know. There were people. And then there's not a lot of bedroom selection. Like what so i'm gonna look at the christmas stuff um and get back to you guys okay i'm hot <laughs> and tired but i went to a bunch of stores i went to at home i went to big lot i went to dollar tree walmart Home Depot and Audi. Um, I didn't get nothing from Big Lock, so you won't see nothing from there, but let's start with at home. So this is what I got from at home. I got a sink stopper, and this is like a cap to put over this. Um, when I moved in this apartment, they gave me like one like this, but it's black, but it's um, thicker, but I needed one for the other sink. This is a two seat sinker. So I bought more of these because I needed some new ones. And then I bought some rags this time. And I bought tongs because my purple tongs broke. So I spent. $29.50 at, at home. And, okay. Um, Dollar Tree. I bought some makeup sponge to wipe off. I bought two of these because um, I'm going to put um, the makeup sponge in here and then the other one I bought, I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna put my Q-tips in here. 
Then I bought some batteries because I needed some. I bought me a new gold leaf because um, the original one I had, I bought, I think, like two-ish years ago, broke. And I think it was my sister, my god sister's boyfriend who accidentally broke it. But I was happy they had a new thing. And them still because you know how Dollar Tree is. They don't always have everything there that's not considered one of their staples. Um, I went to Home Depot and got just two of these. Oh, at Dollar Tree, I forgot to tell you how much I spent. I spent six thirty-three at Dollar Tree. I got two of these light bulbs. Um, I got natural light. I was gonna get the daylight um, LEDs, but they was like $10 for one bulb. And I was like, mm, I don't think I wanna pay $10 for one bulb. <laughs> so I just got the natural light regular, um, the regular one, because really my house don't even look that orange. Uh, with the light bulbs I do have in this out that was given to me, so. But I will tell you why I bought new light bulbs when I show you what I got from Wally World. And if you know me, you know I really don't shop at Wally World at all. But at Home Depot, I spent $10 for four light bulbs. Four forty nine, dollars but it's four. I bought... I've been looking for floor lamps, and like I've been telling you guys, I don't like to spend too much money, especially when I'm about to get rid of, when I move, I'm gonna get rid of all this stuff anyways. So, like, the most expensive item I bought, oh, I didn't tell you, I bought a couch. That was the only expensive item I bought for this house, everything else. Each thing I'm gonna buy, it's not gonna be that expensive, but I bought, um, this black floor lamp it's a 5 by 11 floor lamp for the beauty room and then i got this gold one as you can see for the living room if you pay attention you you'll see the color things for the um house um got some kitchen scissors because i needed some new ones um and then i bought some pans these are for something else that I'm doing. So, yeah. <laughs> I needed some hands. Why am I putting everything on this side? So, yeah. At Wally World, I spent 32 50 And then at Aldi. Aldi, I really went in to go get some... Some wine because the Audis that's by me now, the new one, <laughs> where my new house is, um, they sell alcohol. If you didn't know, Audis that are in areas that are not considered safe does not sell alcohol, but the Audis that are areas that are considered safe does. But I ended up buying other things too. I bought some Gatorade. Yeah, so I bought those three. I bought. <laughs> And water. I'm trying to pull it. So yeah, and then these are the ones I got. I bought the sangria. I bought sweet wine. If y'all wanted to know, I'm a sweet wine drinker. I bought the white um something. I can't pronounce that. But it was another sweet one, I said. Oh, okay. And these are the winking owls. So I bought three winking owls. The Moscato. Then I saw this on Facebook. And I remember that Audi had them. Because people were saying it. But I bought the sweet watermelon one. And then the sweet peach. I did get food. I didn't just buy drinks. Um, turkey bacon. 
onions. Um, they didn't really have the yogurt I normally get, but I got the um, Simply Natural Vanilla yogurt. I grab a thing of shrimp. Bought more bananas. Green beans. Strawberries. And mixed greens. I only bought these um, items because I ran out of them. And it's the middle of the month. Close to the end of the month, the middle of the month for when I normally go shopping for me. So that's why I end up buying them. But yeah, at all these, I spent roughly $48.61. Dang, I just realized this Aldi has two different taxes. Well, three. That sucks. I got tax with tax A, which is um, 0, 0.0. That's zero, dollars, zero cents. Then I got taxed by um, tax B by 5.5. .5, that's 88 cents. And then C taxed, I got 6.0 percent which is 63 cents that sucks i hate that that's a law in wisconsin like if you guys don't know in wisconsin you um the stores can tax you um as many taxes they want so you just don't get one tax in wisconsin you can get two or three Let's see i only got one tax there you don't get tax for dollars. Oh yeah, I got one tax for dollar tree. Oh, that's a gift receipt. That's only one tax. Yeah, one tax. Audi was the only one that taxed me more. That's stupid. But whatever. All right, I'm gonna put stuff up. I'll talk to you later. Hey guys, so I got my couch. I have a knife because I gotta break the tape, but um, I have the couch delivered not to my new address I'm at. I had it delivered somewhere else. <laughs> and then my dad and my god brother brought it up. So watch me bring this couch to life. And yes, I have a steak knife in my hand. And no, it's not sharp. So I'm not gonna cut myself. All right. Okay, so I just finished it, got out the box. I don't know if they, people are gonna be able to see this, but I have a rip on my couch. So I'm gonna assemble it, see if it's seenable, cause it is on the side back piece. So maybe it's not noticeable. I don't wanna send it back. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see.
That was work. <clears throat> Not because, like, I don't know how to put a couch together or anything. Like, first of all, I thought it was going to be more work, like screwing and stuff. The only thing that I needed to screw was the legs. But what was the work was doing it by yourself, like, technically, to put the sides, these, right here, put this put this side piece on I need leverage I should have like had another person because technically you need leverage to lift up one side to put on the other side but how I did it was I just flipped it on the um side flipped this middle piece on the side and then I mean on the um back and then lift it to get the side piece this side piece on and then on the other side I used that as my leverage to put the other side piece on. Now this back piece it's I don't know if it's all the way down and I think it's not because technically it's a sheet that was supposed to come all the way down but I'm not going to stress it because it's facing the uh, wall but I wanted to make sure that part is down and yeah I'm not going to sit back because like I said the part that was ripped was the piece that's facing the wall and it's covered technically so i'm going to show you what i'm talking about see it's covered even on like if i move it to show you like down there it's covered over there and i believe it's on that on that one but i'm gonna show you again on this side like it's covered completely even down there I don't think I can get down there to show you on this side. But yeah, it's covered. So you're not even going to see the red. It's not that big of a deal to me. Um, I did think this couch was bigger. Like as in like coming out more than what it is. But I'm okay with it. I'm going to fluff this up. a little bit more but yeah you actually like sit into the couch so I'm gonna show you like you sit back into the couch that's how comfortable this couch is it, um it's not a couch you sink in I didn't want a couch you sink in I'm sweaty because it took work to put this out yeah, but it's not a couch you like literally sink your whole body in. This is just a couch to just sit on. I didn't want a couch that you sink your body in because that's not what this is for. Just to sit. It's no pillows that you can take off this couch or anything like that. But now I'm going to put my decor back on this and then I'll show you where I put the food down. Okay, so this is the couch with the pillows back on. I um, I like it. I really, really like it. I like the gold and gray. The gray is pulling all the focus on the gold and the black. That one black pillow. Yes, I know that's a Christmas pillow, but it's my only black and gold pillow because the one my friend bought me years ago the gold like just gave away but I like that pillow I'm gonna... so yeah this is how the couch looks it looks so beautiful it'll go better when I get more things to go with this thing I pushed the couch the couch is not centered I didn't want it centered only because I want to put an end table right there so people can charge their phones because it is an outlet on this side so i wanted to put an end table right there and then here i don't want to put anything because this unit closet is right there and i think when christmas come i'm going to be putting the christmas tree right here to cover up that unit closet so, yeah, but as you guys see, I still don't got any other furniture because um, Ikea need to be 
stuff need to be bought online. But yeah, let me go show you where I put the futon. So the futon is in the beauty room. Um, this is where guests will sleep. So this is my beauty room. I got some hair stuff that couldn't fit over in the cubicles. And then I finally finished putting up the beauty vanity. I need to still put up a lot of my canvases and stuff. But this is where the guests will be sleeping when they're um, spending the night. They'll be sleeping right here. I am going to get a mattress topper to make this more comfortable. Um, and then I'm going to decorate it as like a little day bed. So at night, they can push the tops back, take the tops down, and then the bed will spread out. But in the morning, it'll look like a cute little day bed. So it won't be uncomfortable. All right. See you guys when I get more furniture or any other decor things. I need to turn this light off. Any other decor things or furniture. I see you guys in the next clip. Bye.